Three on three basketball is a staple in basketball growing up. It allows movement, exploration, and just the ability to have fun and play when a full court isn't available or not enough players are out there to get a good run. Yeah, hair. What's up, YouTube? It's Scotty Sports Performance with another YouTube video for today. Don't forget to subscribe and check out our Facebook page at Scotty Sports Performance and our blog, which the URL will be in the, the description. The first reason why playing games will improve your basketball game all around is that there was no coach, so you can just play and focus on bettering yourself. When playing threes, there are no plays. There are There's nobody screaming at you to set a down screen or take a charge. It's literally just you and your teammates in the bucket. I feel that this approach is definitely needed in today's day and age because a lot of players don't know how to play the game in its core. A lot of games get to the point where you as a player have to make a move and the coach can't call a play for you. Most games are scenarios where you have to get out of a jam yourself. The second reason is that there is limited space, so physical prowess becomes less of a need. Three on three basketball is usually played on a half court. Half court is a lot less space than a full court game and true speed is not necessarily important. In a full court game and even NBA games, you watch players have a significant advantage over their slower defenders because they can just simply outrun them. Due to the limited space, there's no room to truly outrun your defender. So it causes you to become a more crafty and mindful player to get open and play the game. A lot of these players nowadays are unaware of these subtleties in the game. Understanding how to space the floor and getting into the vision of a driving player is also important on offense. An example of this is when I hoop with these guys on Saturdays. These guys I play with and when we with when we play full court always push the ball up the court to shoot contested threes with no big men down there to rebound. Then complain that there's no rebounding. Not understanding that you are going down there to shoot any shot with no help isn't bright. Learning about a great shot is important in three on three basketball because a bad shot and a missed rebound can turn into two points fast. Defense is important because every possession is defended. Learning how to use your brain in these games will easily transfer to full court. The last reason is you'll just learn how to play off of people naturally. You learn how to play off people naturally because there's a lot of times in today's age you can score off the ball and just freeze up like a popsicle when they don't have the ball. It's crazy to me personally that this can really be an issue, but a lot of kids today don't play sports just to play. They're stuck on a team and a structured environment where the coach is literally worried about winning and doesn't care about making better players. So it's on the player to become a better player. But in actuality, the player doesn't know how to become a better player. So this is definitely something you must take upon yourself. Notice the patterns in your teammates and where they will score or where they like the ball. Become a more aware player. Understand how to play the game instead of being a chess piece in a checkers game. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and check out our Facebook page at Scotty Sports Performance. And also check out our blog, which the description will be in the description box underneath the video. But also please can you comment comment like and also share your thoughts under under the video we would like to have more different ideas and hear what you guys have to say about the video but until then peace